hello everyone welcome to another tutorial video today i am going to show you guys how you can fix some of the problems while you are installing forza horizon 3 today we are going to fix these two problems i am going to show you now first one is access denied okay and the second one is this fix your permissions and remove read only sorry remove read only and try again exiting okay both of them are almost same but access denied should be the easiest one to fix access is denied okay so access is denied means something is interfering with your auto FS tool how can you fix it then okay first of all the most common suggestion is that you turn off your windows defender and any type of anti malware or antivirus software then you should just go to your game folder and then run autoface tool as an in administrator mode i think it should work okay if it is not working just make sure your developer mode is turned on so how can you turn on the developer mode then go to start click on the start menu then go to settings then navigate to update and security then just see a bit down for developers and then as you can see developer mode okay i have already checked it so the developer mode is on in here so the second one that you need to turn off windows defender okay windows defender here you can see my windows defender logo is in here but i will just do it from the start menu or the search bar okay this is the defender and it is turned off how can you turn off go to your settings and then you will see real time protection okay you will just turn it off then it should be just fine and it will show you red okay the second step is done now try auto fs tool in admin mode so your problem should be done you should be able to install it and proceed to the next step of the installation okay now for the second problem those who of you are having fix your permissions read only and try again exiting now this could be a bit tricky okay there are two ways now let me show you to fix this problem you just have to make sure let me show you as an example of this folder actually okay let me go to a drive as you can see this is the opus dev game folder i have in here and you can see it is still 53 for 9 gigs that means this is the original game folder okay so those who have fixed this in the easiest way they just clicked right clicked on it and go to the properties and then uncheck the read only and apply and click ok and again ok and they ran the auto fs tool and then the problem was solved for them. and they also make sure that windows defender or any other anti malware softwares are turned off so now for those who just go around a bit and then fix the problem so those guys must need to take ownership of the game folder this is a must because sometimes the normal read only mode it doesn't work okay you just have to take the ownership and then remove this read only and finally it should work fine because one of my friend have tested it and his game is working now and he is very happy about it okay so how to take ownership of the folder you just right click and go to properties and then navigate to the security option sorry security tab in here and then head to advanced okay now as you can see this is the owner so i will change the owner by clicking on the change button and then type your user name okay so don't type anything wrong then it will not work okay my username is currently devil so i will be typing devil as you can see and i will click here check names and you can see it is correct and there should be a line and you if your username is wrong it should not be like this it should be an error warning 
okay so i will just hit okay and then click here replace owner and sub containers and objects and click apply as you can see there is a dialog box that i have taken ownership of this folder and i will hit okay it might take few more seconds so just be patient okay now click okay and again hit okay so i have taken the ownership of this upper day folder or the game folder now just right click and go to properties once again and just uncheck the read only and then apply then again okay and finally again okay so it should be done now the problem is solved for the fix permissions and remove read only you must need to make sure that your windows version is accurate your antivirus or anti malware is turned off and there is no interference or there is no any background program working while you are installing this so there won't be any kind of interference so as you can see guys the the problems i have showed you can be solved in this way and i hope this video will help you a lot if you like my video please give me a thumbs up if you don't like it please give me a dislike please share it with your friends and subscribe for more awesome videos like this and have a great day everyone Welcome.